kids i hope you all are fit and fine at your places so kids our today's video is based on chapter 11 the valley of flowers kids it's part 3 see kids we have discussed many topics in part 1 and 2 the last topic of part 2 video of this chapter uses of flowers yes kids the last topic which we have discussed was uses of flowers now in the topic uses of flowers we have studied that flowers are also called as vegetables yes there are many flowers which are edible now edible means that we can cook them as vegetable this was the first use of flower secondly we have studied that flowers are used as medicines yes flowers are used as medicines now the third use of flower is it is used for making colors yes kids the flowers are also used for making colors and what are the flowers from which we can make colors the flowers are marigold zinnia saffron there are many flowers from which we can make colors so kids with flowers you can make colors now kids in this chapter the valley of flowers in our first video which was part 1 we have discussed about one folk art which was madhubani art yes kids i hope you remember in that art we have discussed that the people of bihar use natural colors for their folk art so kids these natural colors are made from the flowers only now with flowers you can also make scents now what is the meaning of scent see kids whenever you go to any party or any marriage function or any occasion so you put dio scent or perfume on you yes kids that scent gives you a good smell yes lovely smell so that scents are also made from the flowers only now these scents are made from rose lavender lilies so these scents are made from many flowers like rose lavender lilies etc now kids we will study about one special scent that is itr now kids in your left hand side you can see the bottle of itr now this is small bottle of itr is made from lots and lots of flowers yes now kids let's move to the india's map now here you can see the map of india in this map of india the state is there marked uttar pradesh now kids in this uttar pradesh there is one district named kannauj yes kids in this uttar pradesh you can see in your right hand side there uttar pradesh in this state uttar pradesh 
it is a state there is one district which is named kannauj it is a district kannauj is a district in state uttar pradesh you can see kids the kannauj district in the map of uttar pradesh now kids this district is famous for its itr yes this district is famous for its itr in this district the people used to bring thousands of flowers every day from the neighboring areas to create this itr and kids this itr is just like the perfume which you use but the difference is that it has strong and lovely smell and it is made up of thousands of flowers now with this itr the people of kannauj are also engaged in making rose water yes one more name of rose water is gulab jal they are engaged in making rose water and they are also engaged in making kevra water now kids this kevra water is just like rose water and it is also used in cleaning your eyes and face now kids have you heard any song about flowers see kids in your left hand side there is one song related to flowers i think you can read it nicely see kids the song is in hindi and english language both now in this song kids there is one bride and bride groom yes bride means dulhan and bride groom means dulha now in this song the bride is telling the gardener to make a garland yes garland for her bride groom yes kids so this poem is all about the flowers the beauty of flowers so kids we have learned one more use of flowers and it is that the flowers are also used in songs kids we use flowers in different occasions as birthdays religious ceremonies marriages and many more occasions you can see in your left hand side kids about the different occasions and the different types of flowers used in that occasion like when we go for a marriage we used to take a bouquet of flowers yes now kids just think about it there are so many uses of flowers and to fulfill all these needs we want lots and lots of flowers so kids just think about the beautiful garden of flowers kids now move to the last topic of this chapter which is flower seller i think kids many of you have seen the flower sellers around the road side yes many people used to sit along the road side to sell the flowers now from where these flower sellers bring the flowers from where they bring the flowers from the horticulture farms and from the gardens they bring the flowers from the horticulture farms and the gardens and kids why do people buy flowers see we used to buy flowers for many reasons the first is for giving as gift to others yes when we are going in a 
marriage ceremony or we going in a birthday party or in a religious ceremony so we used to take a flower bouquet with us so flowers are used or the flowers are buy to give the gift to others secondly flowers are also used for decoration we decorate our home we decorate many places with the flowers as by decorating with the flowers the place looks beautiful thirdly we also use flower as worship whenever we go to temples we take flowers with us for worshiping so kids we use flowers in many ways yes and for many purposes flowers are edible flowers are used as medicines flowers are used as colors scents and in songs also so kids in this chapter we have studied lots of uses of flowers and i think you all remember the all the uses of flowers very nicely now kids before moving to the activity corner i just want to show you one pic yes kids you can see the pic of a flower now in this flower you can see the sepals and petals yes kids buds and flowers both have sepals and petals yes kids buds are closed and flowers are open but they both have sepals and petals and you can see kids sepals and petals in this flower picture now kids let's move to the activity corner page number 87 why this have you ever seen a board like this put up anywhere yes in public parks and gardens do people pluck flowers even when this board is there no why do you think they do this for fun they do this should they do this no it is a bad habit what would happen if everybody plucked flowers it will destroy the beauty and color of the place page number 88 Let us look closely. Now in this activity kids you have to take one or two flowers. Remember that you must collect only fallen flowers. Do not pluck any flower as it is a bad habit. Now in this activity I have taken rose flower. You can take any flower of your choice. Now what is the color of the flower? it's red in color what kind of a scent does it have it has a very lovely scent what does it look like a bell a bowl a brush or anything else it looks like a bowl do these flowers grow in bunches no they do not grow in bunches usually how many petals does it have it has about 4200 petals are all the petals joined together or separate the petals of the flower are separate outside the petals can you see any green leafy structure how many are there yes i can see four such structures inside the petals in the middle of the flower can you see some thin structures write its color yes the color of the structure is pink red when you touch these do you find a powdery thing on your hands yes i found a powdery thing on my hands when touching it page number 89 topic blooming buds the first question what differences do you find between a flower and a bud a bud is smaller than a flower buds are actually the very early phase of flower formation now kids next is an activity 
choose a bud that is growing on a plant and look at it every day write the name of the plant now here i have taken a rose plant you can take any plant of your choice now when you first saw this bud the date was 25 july now when the bud has bloomed into a flower the date is 30 july how many days did the bud take to become a flower it took 5 days for the bud to become a flower and the date was from 25 to 30 july ask your friends the names of the different flowers that they have seen how much time did it take their buds to become flowers now kids hibiscus bud takes 7 days to become a flower sunflower's bud takes 7 to 8 days to become a flower also observe how many days the same flower took to dry as the rose flower took 30 to 40 days to dry page number 91 find out and write the names of some more flowers that are used for making colors rose saffron and hibiscus can you think of a color of which there is no flower grey and silver write the names of such flowers which are used to make scent lavender jasmine rose page number 92 talk about it do you know when such songs are sung marriages do you or anybody else at home know other such songs yes my grandmother and auntie are any special flowers used on certain occasions festivals by your elders make a list of different occasions and the flowers used at each now the first is birthday name of flower rose tulip second marriage name of flower bouquet third religious ceremony name of flower marigold fourth friendship day name of flower pink and red rose and the last death answer is bouquet page number 93 let us know some more now kids have you seen any flower sellers you have to ask these questions from them and you have to write the answers what are the different flowers that they sell ask them the names of three flowers rose jasmine dahlia where do they bring these flowers from they bring these flowers from horticulture farms and gardens why do people buy flowers people buy flowers for decoration worship and to gift others now kids in this activity you have to take the pictures now as you know kids flower sellers sell their flowers in different forms so you have to take the picture which you have seen page number 94 any other form that you have seen sellers sell flowers in the form of gajra have you seen flowers offered at many religious places like temples yes what do we do when they dry up we dispose as waste how will you use them to make dry colors for holy festival now some flowers are used in different forms like rose and marigold are used in garlands and as loose petals too now here you have to write the prices one flower rupees 10 one garland cost rupees 50 and one bouquet cost rupees 200 has the flower seller learned to make bouquet 
or a net of flowers from anybody from whom from his father or elders would they like the other members of their family to do this work why yes as it makes some extra earning for the flower seller